little bit. Hi, I'm Sheila from the Kitchen Critic, and I'm sharing recipes with you, and welcome to my family. And today we're going to start off with some cucumber bites as an appetizer. I'm going to be grilling um, a whole meal today, but I'm going to start off with these cucumber bites because I, everybody loves a good appetizer when it comes to a cookout. So what I have is I all of this ready I've taken I've taken two cucumbers and I cut them up and I sliced them in a half inch thick slices and then I dug out a little hole in the center of it but don't go all the way through some of them I did but that's okay it's not gonna make that big of a deal and then I've got some uh, tomatoes here some garlic powder he calls for garlic salt but I so I'm using garlic powder I'll do my own salt and pepper and then I've got some fresh that I got out of my herb garden that's behind me and I've got some ranch dressing some mayonnaise well three tablespoons of ranch dressing one tablespoon of mayonnaise and four ounces of cream cheese so the first thing that I'm going to mix together is the cream cheese and the mayonnaise I got some dill on my thing too so it's going in here so it doesn't make that big of a difference and then you put your ranch dressing in here. Now I've never tried these, so we're gonna be trying these for the first time and John will give you his critique whenever we're done with this to tell you how it tastes and I will be too. So we're gonna mix this really well together. I'm gonna to use my spoon here. one tablespoon of fresh dill and this smells so good and then my one quarter of garlic powder here well was going to stuck to the bowl so we're going to mix all of this together Now what I'm going to do, make, and this takes no time at all, you can make these everything ahead of time and then assemble them when the time comes. I'm going to double spoon it. It says you could, you could use, you can use a pastry bag. It says you can use a bag or clip off the corner of a sandwich bag. I just double spoon it. Sometimes if I'm just fixing it for me and John, I'll just use my finger. But we're going to do it the proper way today. So then we're going to take this here, put it in there. And we're going to do each one of these this way. Like I said, very easy. Oh, and these cucumbers came from my oldest son, Nicholas, his garden. He gave these to and you can't beat garden fresh cucumbers and garden fresh tomatoes because I'm going to tell you what one of my favorite meals in the summertime is a tomato a mayonnaise sandwich but I, I will tell you I only use Duke's mayonnaise so if you use any other kind of mayonnaise I'm not responsible for the flavor that comes out I think I've put too much in each one of them, but you know what? I didn't put the topping on it so I can steal from others. That's the great thing about cooking is you can adapt it to your own, adapt it to your cooking. Um, 